best athletes certainly know getting off to the right start is key to a good performance. So when we asked Olympic skier Jan Huditz for a restaurant recommendation, he told us how much he loves Red's Diner. This is a breakfast specialty joint which now has a second location in Ramsey. Ryan Oldehuvel joins us. Welcome. Hi, how are you doing? I'm, I'm very well, and I'm so excited about this because uh, Jan and I share a mutual love for Reds, and in particular for this dish, right? Yes. You're the one that told me to try it, actually, and I did, and I had other ones that I liked when I tried this. Uh... But this one came top. Oh, man. <laughs> okay, so yeah. what are you, you going to make for us this uh, morning? Today we're making short rib hash, which is triple-A uh, boneless short rib from Alberta Raised. And uh, with potatoes, also local Alberta potatoes grown here. And uh, yeah. And a bunch of other delicious And we'll do stuff. scrambled eggs on top and make it big, huge, nice okay. breakfast for everybody. And you will never, never, ever leave Reds hungry. <laughs> no, ever. You, that's for sure. Ever, you ever. Won't, you won't. You'll leave Reds and go for a nap. After. And how, long, how long has the Ramsey location been open? We've been open for about six months now. Yeah. And what do you usually get? Because this is your new favorite, but you have other favorites too. Um, here's a. Pretty much anything. And I live like, I'm not going to tell you the address so I don't get <laughs> no. any creepers. Okay. But I live like right beside Red's <laughs> Diner. So at the beginning it was like just out of convenience and then I like started trying everything on the menu and I was like, okay, yeah, I'm, I'm stuck. But like the, the, the ranch and roll wrap? Yeah, that's always a big it's, seller for it's us. Spicy and it's spicy but it's so awesome. And yeah. So if you want, yeah. Does, every, everything's good. <laughs> Autograph, you know where to find them. You know him. where to find them, yeah. <laughs> okay, so let's uh, let's get started. So okay. what, are we, uh, what are we doing? So we got uh, onions and peppers that we already cut up, sauteing in just a bit of oil. And we're going to add the uh, short rib, which is pre-cooked now because yep. of the show. We do do this with wine and bay leaves and onions, and we braise it for like seven to eight hours until it really falls, like almost like pulled pork. Yeah. Oh. Which we've done so in yeah, before right. so that, yeah. For time's sake, but and you guys don't spare or anything, right? No, we definitely it. don't. We definitely notice don't. how he's not afraid of the butter. Nope. No. Nope. Oh. He you can't be I afraid of it? butter, that's for sure. Most chefs are no good without butter, right? Exactly. Okay, so that's the butter. This is butter and <laughs> oil together, because if we just put just butter, it's gonna burn, and we don't want that. Okay. So we put them a little bit together, but it's mostly butter. So the potatoes are par yep. boiled. Yeah, these are just par cooked, and then we're gonna just heat them up till we get them nice and crispy with a little bit of uh, green onions, which actually we want to add a little bit more here. Okay. Yeah. If there's anything is back backseat cooking, there's no need here. No, no he backseat cooking. He knows what he's cooking. doing. Ryan's got this covered. Yeah, how do you sort of? I mean, how many calories do you need when you're? In, in <laughs> I think we got season? it covered. Probably. <laughs> yeah. Is that, is that adequate? I usually don't eat for the rest of the day. After I go to Reds? Because I don't need to. You don't need no, to. But no, but <laughs> I, I don't watch my calories. You don't need to. I don't know if you can tell. I was hoping a white shirt would be slimming on TV. <laughs> Come on, you look good. Um, yeah, downhill skiers need momentum, so it's perfect for us. <laughs> uh, so we'll add a bit of paprika and a little bit of seasoning salt to the potatoes. Oh, yeah. Would you, are there any secret ingredients to this? Well, it wouldn't be a secret if I told you, would it? <laughs> it's kind of trickier. No, there's not. <laughs> okay, so, and then, cool. so this all cooks up. Yeah, we're just going to let this cook a little bit, and then we'll add a little bit of water to the short rib just to rehydrate it a little bit and to get, like, the fat that's in it kind of to come out again. Yeah, the fat. Okay, so we're going to let you continue, mm. uh, Ryan, and then, of course, the eggs are the final ingredient. Yep. We're going to show this off uh, when it's all done. For now, we're going to check.